What's up guys? Today we are watching season 3, episode 3 of Breaking Bad. So, last episode was kind of like a bit hectic. You know, Walt and Skyler aren't really on speaking terms much and he was ranting about that to Saul and after that, Saul made a call. It's kind of weird that that rhymed, but he made a call and it kind of seems like he's trying to get Skyler killed or something, but we'll see if that actually happens. But also, Jesse ended up buying his old house with the help of Saul also. So I love that he was able to do that. And by the end of the episode, Tuco's cousins or something were trying to kill Walt, you know, because Tuco's grandpa told them to basically. And they were about to go through with it, but then they got a text from chicken dude i don't remember his name they got a text from him and he basically saved walt's life and i just want to see what's going to end up happening with walt and how he's possibly going to get back into the business since he hasn't been like in it in a while so i guess let's just get into the episode Existe la máquina. ¿Puede romper un sello? wait a minute Hay dos clases de hombre en, en este mundo. He is in like everything, bro. Cause didn't he play like a character in Wizards of Waverly Place one time? And then I know he was in the Snickers commercial. There's other shit he's been in, but I've mostly seen him in stuff where he's not playing like too serious of a character. Pero siempre Él termina primero. Sí, yo sé. Por eso te llaman así. ¿Sabes? Me encanta cómo hablas, Tortuga. ¿Sí? Why does that name sound familiar? What's it that episode whenever Hank was on a different team and then they were talking about something and then it ended up being dude's head on a tortoise? I don't think it's the same situation, but it just reminded me of that. No, no necesita molestarte, jefe. No, no te preocupes, quise hacerlo. Lo tengo ahí atrás. I don't know if I would trust that. He's going to kill you, isn't he? Qué chulada. Serio, te gusta? He got you a turtle. Amazing. Um. His head is going on the tortoise next, isn't it? He didn't even last 10 minutes. I thought he was going to be a new character. The looks of him, he has no idea how close he came. I'm assuming Saul Goodman doesn't need to know. Mom's the word. Wait. Okay, yeah, it's still like the same day from the other thing. So where the hell is Skylar? When is she going to see that? He came home without her knowing. <laughs> Knew it was going to be sometime soon. What? What the hell are you doing in there? I'm back. No! No, you're not back! She ain't going to end up going back in and she's going to go sleep somewhere else. Okay. No, no, there's nothing to talk about. I am not coming in there until you get out. Well, it's like sometimes I want to say she's over exaggerating, but then I also don't think she is. So it's like she kind of is, she kind of isn't. If you don't get out of here right now, I'm going to call the police and I'm going to tell them everything. I mean it. Is he going to think about what Saul said and call it a bluff? Mm. 
Why does she need to look in a phone book? I thought you were just going to call 911. Right hand to God, I will tell them. Do what you have to do, Skylar. This family is everything to me. Oh, so he's letting her. Thank you. They're coming. Obviously, he watched you the whole call. It isn't going to be a police person. It's going to be someone else. Because that was quick. Dad's here? Right, he's home. Dad! Hey, son. <laughs> So it was Walter Jr. Knew it. Well, not specifically that it was him, but... Billy, what does that mean? <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. Is that not too stringy or something? I never had grilled cheese, so... But I feel like the cheese would have been more melted or something. You called the cops on dad? I, um, no, this is not about violence. This is about trespassing, about him being here against my will. Are they not going to take it that seriously since he's not, like, abusive? Breaking and entering? Whose name is on the title to the house? Both of us. It's, it's, um... It's jointly owned. We can't arrest a man for breaking into his own house. They can't do anything since they're not fully divorced yet. I'm going to level with you, ma'am. If you want your husband out of the house, you're going to have to help me out. Is it possible maybe he's broken any laws that you know of? Anything at all? Now's your chance to tell him. You said you were going to. I don't know why she's being this way. My my dad, he is a great guy. Son. It really kills her that she says that he says that about Walter. But what's gonna happen whenever Walter Jr. finds out what really happened? You should call this number. It's the family hotline. I'd really look into some counseling. That's lucky, folks. What if they actually end up in, like, family therapy, though? Welcome home. See, it's so strange because Walt looks mean, but when you hear him, he sounds like a regular dude. But he's playing it so nice, so they don't suspect anything in a way, but... He lives! Happy housewarming, kid. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that was about to be Walter, but... Yourself get back to cooking. I mean, you being in rehab and all, I only want you to convince the master chef to do his thing, so... What do you say? I say you're pushing Jesse too much. If you get the maestro cooking again, I'll make it worth your while. <sighs> Call him. He just hasn't decorated yet, unless he actually did spend all his money on that house. I thought he had like, was it not six mil? I mean, 600K? Something. Schrader. Yes, sir. Yeah, what's up? Yeah? Is it gonna be another head on a tortoise thing? She gonna keep me in suspense or what? What's the good news? Mercury called in a couple of favors. El Paso wants me back. Ah. 
congrats, man. That's fantastic. I didn't think he would want to go back there. Or is it only because of that case? Oh wait, he doesn't even know about... I'm just assuming that there's a freaking head on a tortoise, so... He doesn't know anything about it. Who is that? See, I was going to automatically assume it might have been Walt's mom, but I'm not too sure. So it was just a random lady and they just took her car for that. Dude from earlier who killed other dude. So he's gonna be there to talk to them about like why not to kill Walter? Strike a deal for something. Or you tenías el derecho de bendecirle a orden, pero no había razón por creer que ese hombre era pendiente tuyo. Pues sí. Oh, they're apologizing to him. Era. Fue leal. Este Heisenberg, Walter White, era uno de los proveedores locales de Tuco. See, at this point, there was no, like, point for Walt to have his alter name Heisenberg, since they know his real name now. Con este señor. Cuando nuestros negocios se terminen, no me importará lo que hagan con él. But when is that going to be? I feel like you're going to keep coming back and doing more business with them. Les aconsejaré que tengan paciencia, pero te recomiendo que termines tu negocio con este hombre rápidamente. O riesgas perder el apoyo del cartel. So they're going to try and rush this man. When shit hasn't even started. No son como tú y yo. They haven't spoken a word yet. Are they ever going to? For you. I'm just now realizing he's in the baby's room. Skylar, can I use the bathroom? Wouldn't there be a bathroom out there? A secret. I can't tell a soul unless you authorize me to. Even if it's something illegal. Especially if it's illegal. Oh no. Oh no. Sh is she gonna tell her? My husband makes meth. Methamphetamine. Saul, I thought you said she was gonna bluff. She's telling someone. I'll go in ex parte to get a restraining order from the court Today, if he comes anywhere near you and your children, he'll go straight to jail. No questions asked. Is she really gonna go through with that, though? I can't do it. Why not? I want my son to find out that his father is a criminal. Resolve themselves on their own without anyone else knowing. So you just want him to die on his own from cancer and just tell people that he's been a great husband and then you can just live your life. 
it's been through a couple of guys already. So when are you headed back down to El Paso? Uh, you know, between the packing and arrows. Isn't that where dude was at earlier? Like the dude that died? I thought something bad was gonna happen, but he's having flashbacks of shit. Cause he was in a bad headspace last time. He was over there. Is he about to do something without them knowing that he's a DEA agent? Not smart, Hank. Hank! Hank, since when are you this violent? DA! Don't move! How are you gonna explain that one to them? You went after them for like no reason in a way, but like you can't give them your reason? Or is that gonna be like reason enough for them? So is every scene going to be of him just calling her number? The number you have reached 1494985 in area code 505 is no longer So then they disconnect the number? Gonna try cooking this shit on your own. For yourself though, I didn't think you were in business in business with anyone. Skylar. Can we talk? She just saw all the money. Is that gonna change how she feels somehow? Decided to call it in. You stayed to keep an eye on the suspects. That's when they attacked you. So you've given him a story to use. That is college tuition for Walter Jr. and Holly. 18 years down the road. So she's really gonna start listening now. After seeing the money. Tell her that money is for this roof over your head. The mortgage that you are not going to be able to afford on a part-time bookkeeper's salary when I'm gone. Don't bring that up for her, man. That's kind of not fair. And it's like, it's good that you're telling her the truth. But it's like, when you're turning it in your favor like that, trying to say you can't live without me in a way, that's, that's some BS. All of it be for nothing if you don't accept what I've earned. Please. It's kind of like, how do you ask someone to do that? Like... What you doing there, Skyler? What did I say? I knew it was gonna happen sometime. Why are your kids home? <clears throat> You're just gonna be with another criminal. How is that different? They just do different things, but they're still both criminals. You make no sense. Mm. 
now that I think about it, would that be a reason for Walt to want to leave her? You know, maybe she was trying to give him a reason to leave her. I don't know. Unless that's just not the case. Look, I, I just want to say that I... I feel good about our talk this morning, and I'm, I'm very eager to hear what you're thinking about... about what we talked about. She looks like she's just numb, in a way, to, like, feeling shit. She looks angry, but also not, you know, expressionless. I fucked Ted. So maybe I was right. Maybe she's trying to give him a reason to leave. But would that be even more of a reason to stay? But then if you think about it, he never cheated. So that's bad on her end. But they're both in bad situations. He's making meth. You just cheated. Good for you. Thanks, darling. Thank you. Oh, come on. I thought there was going to be more to the episode. But it's like, I just want to know what Walter is going to do. Is Walter going to go after the dude? Like, he knows, he knows who she's talking about. He was just, he drove her to deliver her baby, you know? But it's like, I don't know how Walt is going to act because Walt's, I can't say Walt's not a murderer because he did kill like that one dude in season one. I'm pretty sure there's other people, but that's just like the m main dude I'm thinking about. But like, he also blew up a place. So you can't really know what Walter's going to do because you know he has this alter personality so maybe he's gonna go into his alter like personality thing he might kill ted was his name ted that's just what i'm gonna call him but you know who i'm talking about i feel bad that she did it but also like i said earlier i think that's probably like a way for her to like try and get him to like finalize the divorce because at that point nothing else seemed to be working she even told the lady that he makes meth so it's like saul was wrong she didn't bluff and now she basically gave walter a reason to want to divorce but the thing is is walter jr gonna figure out that she cheated because then at that point he's gonna know that she cheated He's not going to know what Walt did, so he's going to blame her. You never know how it's going to turn out. Fuck, there's so much shit that can happen because he can also somehow figure out what he did. Like, how Walt makes meth. But that's kind of like what, um, what's her name? What Skyla's trying not to do. She doesn't want her kids to think that their dad is a bad person. But if he finds out what she did that plan's gonna backfire my god so much shit and then jesse i love jesse this whole episode he's just been listening to jane's voicemail and then it finally went out and i feel bad for him more now but it's like he also just went and like it looked like he was about to try and do meth and like make the meth on his own. So it was like I was thinking earlier, is he doing that for himself or is he going to try and sell it? You know, there is too much that could happen in this show. It's just like, I feel like probably by next episode, something, something is bound to happen. Like a sudden kind of twist, escalate into something that could be wrong. Because I also don't know what it could be. But you know, the show is kind of unpredictable. But. And Hank. What's going on with Hank? We saw a violence in him that we have never really seen before. 
man took down guys on his own. Broke his jaw, it looked like. But more than that, broke the back of his head. Smashed his head. He was going wild. And it's like... He's just... I feel bad because we're so used to his, like, gentle side. And then we get a rage of violence. You see, that's kind of like a Walter moment. He kind of went from his old persona and then bam, violence. It's weird to say it that way, but... But I, I do feel bad that his friend is taking up for him because it kind of seems like he owes him in a way. Or maybe his friend's not like that. But he does kind of owe him an explanation but it's like how do you explain that he had tough feelings for shit back in the last season and then now it's resurfacing like resurfacing because of this thing it's like what else is gonna happen for these people <laughs> i don't know i'm just ready to see how walt's gonna take this whole thing with Skylar cheating so I guess come back for episode 4 